The author describes the journey of a group of family heads from Babylon during King Artaxerxes' reign. They were led by Gershom, Daniel, David, Shekaniah, Parosh, Aden, Jeshiah, Zebediah, Joab, Bani, Babai, and Asgad. They were assembled at the Ahava Canal and camped there for three days. When they checked, they found no Levites present. They summoned Eliezer, Ariel, Shemaiah, Elnathan, Jerib, Elnathan, Nathan, Zechariah, Meshulam, and Joyarib, and Elnathan, who were leaders and men of learning. They were instructed to bring attendants to the house of God in Kasiphia. The leaders, Sherebiah, Hashabiah, and Jeshiah, along with 220 temple servants, were brought to the house of God. The priests and Levites were set apart and offered silver and gold, as well as the articles donated by the king, his advisors, officials, and all Israel present. The silver and gold were consecrated to the Lord, and they were guarded carefully until they were weighed out in the chambers of the house of God in Jerusalem. On the twelfth day of the first month, the group set out from the Ahava Canal to Jerusalem. The hand of God protected them from enemies and bandits along the way. They arrived in Jerusalem and rested for three days. On the fourth day, the silver and gold were weighed out in the house of God, and the exiles who had returned from captivity sacrificed burnt offerings to the God of Israel. They also delivered the king's orders to the royal satraps and governors of Trans-Euphrates, who then provided assistance to the people and the house of God. <laughs>